What's up, what's up, what's up, boys and girls? I'm Plant Powers, and this is Partisans 1941, a real time tactics game with stealth elements, set on the eastern front of World War II. Uh, this is sort of like a Desperados uh, type game, Commandos type game, so this will be very interesting to, set, uh, to play. Uh, if you don't know the meaning of Partisan, which uh, I personally I didn't, as English is not my first uh, language. Uh, a partisan is a member of a, a troop. Hold up, I had this. Uh, here we go. A member of an irregular military force formed to oppose control of an area by a foreign power or by an army of occupation by some kind of insurgent activity. But they were a member of troops that used to operate behind enemy lines, disrupting. So, yeah, let's uh, get into it. This should be very interesting. At 4 a.m. on June the 22nd, 1941, the armed forces of Germany launched a surprise attack against the Soviet Union. The great patriotic war of the Soviet people against the fascist invaders began. In the first several months, the Soviet forces suffered devastating losses, fighting against a battle-hardened and ruthless enemy. The Red Army was forced to retreat. The invaders stormed their way forward, raising Soviet cities to the ground and burning down villages along the way. Minsk, Smolensk and Novgorod fell. The German Air Force bombed Kiev and Sevastopol. Threat loomed over Moscow and Leningrad. Thousands of Soviet soldiers were surrounded, trapped in salience. One of them was a commanding officer of a rifle company, Captain Zorin. During an attempt to break out of the encirclement, he was taken prisoner and shipped to the nearest Dulag. He was supposed to be transferred from the prisoner of war camp to an internment camp. Fully aware that this would be a one-way ticket for him and his comrades, Zorin began work on a breakout. But the Germans discovered his plans. Okay, here we go. It doesn't look... doesn't sound very good to a commander. The Iron Cross there. I don't think they can... It's a bit weird that... Anyways. Warum sind Sie seltsam angezogen? Es hat etwas gedauert, bis wir diese zwei im Wald geschnappt haben, Herr Kommandant. Hauptmann Sorin. Captain Sorin. I've been informed... ...dass Sie die... That you put the prisoners up to a riot. What are you trying to do? Your war is over. Soon it will be over for the Red Army too. I wouldn't be so sure. We'll be chasing you all the way back to Berlin Our victory is all but certain. Neither Moscow nor Leningrad can hold out for more than two weeks. You don't stand a chance against the might of Germany. We, Aryans, are born to rule the likes of you. All humans are born equal. But you, Hitler's filth, you are human. Was für ein Schwachsinn. Bringt ihn nach draußen zur Exekution. So gut wie er delikt, Herr Kommandant. Holy moly, taking us to the firing squad. That's so cool that they have the, the German uh, bit and the interpreter uh, translating the Germans. That's so cool. Right. Go ahead, you bastard. Shoot. There's 170 million of us. You can't shoot everyone. Oh, get him. Oh, nice. Let's break free. The, alarm. the sergeant must have started the riot. I wish I were with them. Now I'll have to escape on my own. I can't even hold a rifle. My hands are tied. I'll try and sneak along the fence while the guards are looking. Right, first order of business is to liberate ourselves from uh, these uh, cuffs. I, I, I was saying before, it's uh, it's very weird to me. I mean, uh, maybe it's out of respect. But the... Uh, the not the Iron Cross, but the other Nazi emblem, the, uh, the swastika. 
it's a very maybe it's a very touchy subject to put in games and media and but uh, there's a lot of places that you they, it just gets replaced and it's weird because it's not even a, a German symbol. It was used in religion a long time ago. I'm not sure in which religions it were, but it was a, the Germans took over the symbol for themselves. Anyways, let's uh, play the game. <laughs> Controlling your character. Use the LBM left mouse button to move your partisan or select an action. Click the right mouse button to cancel a move or an action. Okay. Use WSD keys to move the camera. You can rotate Q and E. That we've been doing that already. Use your mouse wheel to change camera distance. Okay, so this is all the zoom in, and that's all the zoom out. It's not there's not a lot of range to it, but I'm sure you'll be enough. Okay, so there is. If I double click, I can like run. But it seems that the guards may be able to hear it. I think whilst we're crouching, we don't. There's no sound wave uh, happening. Uh, stealth mode. Your character starts with using stealth movement if you're close to an enemy. Oh, that's cool. That's very handy. Oh, there's the uh, iconic vision cone. Okay, move along then. Seems to have disappeared. Not sure... Let's grab this uh, question mark. Every enemy in the game has a cone of vision. Move your cursor to an enemy and press the uh, right mouse button to see it. Keep out of the cone and don't get caught. Okay, cool. So, yeah, alright. So let's just wait. Okay, let's go. Oh. Nice. You can quick save your game by pressing F5. If you want to quick load your last save, press F9. Note that saving is impossible on the game's highest complexity level. We are playing this at normal difficulty, by the way. You can change settings in the settings tab in the game's menu. You can change game settings such as showing exact hit chance numbers. Oh, there's a hit chance? In the game's main menu in the game settings tab. Oh, okay. Uh, see that. Settings, game... So we're playing at normal. Uh, show hit chances in percentages. Um, maybe just leave this off for now? I don't know. Actually, I don't know. Maybe let's let's put this on just to check. Okay. Alright, let's get past this guy. Oh! Oh, that was close. Let's see what the other... So, these are prisoners, I assume, inside this uh, barracks here. Can we go? Yeah, go, go. There's a lot of guards j j just for uh, five prisoners. Double click uh, to sprint. Uh, your characters make noise when they're sprinting. Keep this in mind. Okay, yeah, we kind of figured this. Oh, there's a guy coming from up top. More guards down here. This guy's in yellow, I'm not sure. Oh, maybe they're civilians? Quiet. Someone's escaped the POW. Um, you can use certain objects in your environment to hide from enemies. Use the cellar by clicking it on with the left mouse button to escape the patrolling enemy's gaze. Click the right mouse button to exit the cellar. To highlight objects you can interact with, press Alt button. Alright, cool. So, can I... Oh my god! Now. Was I... <laughs> Was I seen? Okay, no. We do have some time in which uh, we don't get spotted. That's good. We don't get spotted immediately. Because we'll, we'll be tripping up sometimes. More guards down here. Let's uh, hide in the cellar, shall we? Oh, don't make too much noise. Even though the wave is relatively close to us, it seems that they can hear... Uh from a, a much greater distance. It says it exits. Move slowly now. Alright, if we run here, can he hear us? No, okay. Uh, where shall we go? Oh. Oh my... Goodness. Halt euch auf! Durchsucht das Dorf und den Wald! Findet und erschießt die Flüchtigen, es darf niemand entkommen. 
zu Befehl. Soldaten, mitkommen. Jesus. They are taking this very seriously. To scour the area. Someone must have escaped. Y yeah, uh, us. <laughs> no. You just escaped, Zorin. Look at this armored vehicle. This is very cool. I'm not sure how accurate this is, but probably. Uh, let's go inside here then. Be careful now. It was this is over over the box and click on the interaction icon to select an item and drag it to you with your cursor. Double click your left mouse button and click take all. Okay, so we have some loot as well. That's Calm down. all right. So we have a knife, seems, and I don't know what this is. Some foods maybe carrots and tomato. So. Okay, so we have an inventory. That's pretty cool. Well, let me just see what this is. Oh, there's a bunch of item equipment. Press I to open your inventory and equip your knife in into the upper weapon slots. Drag and drop the item to the right slots or double click your left mouse button to equip. Okay, that's pretty cool. So that's equipped on us now. So there's injuries. Command Zorin, okay. Zorin, Alexei, Yuri. Yuri Vich, born in uh, Verko, Verkovino village in the Kalinin region to the farmer's village family. Career officer, participated in the Soviet Finnish war. By the outbreak of the Great Patriotic War, reached the rank of captain. The, com the company he commanded transported to the front lines in the early days of the war. Skilled knife fighter. So he is Russian, although his English is much better than mine. <laughs> Uh, we can also sort items and we can destroy items. What is this though? Oh, information. Nice. Vegetables. Okay, cool. So we have a knife. So our hands are not bound anymore. So can I go in here? Is anyone looking at us? So the civilians don't seem to mind us, I think. It's good. Oh, snap. He just got butt whipped. Stealth killing. Stealthy takedowns allow you... To quickly kill your target, however, your prey will resist for a short while, producing noise that could be heard by other enemies. You can hide enemy corpses using environmental objects to keep them from being found. Okay. Alright, this is pretty standard. Oh, he just got bitch slapped and he's running away now. So, can we kill this guy? Kill him. Oof, that is brutal. Let's pick him up. And where can we... Can we place him in here? There we go, in the toilets. Okay. Get down. I like that the, it goes into stealth automatically. Let's see what this... Uh, enemies can't see you while you are moving through bushes, sneaking to the next yard using bushes. Enemies can't see a corpse in the bushes unless they walk into it. Use this to avoid being caught. Okay. So how thick are these... This is pretty thick. Oh! Noise in bushes. Moving through bushes creates noise that can cause nearby enemies to become suspicious. If your plan was to remain undetected, wait for their suspicion level to decrease before carrying on. Oh, okay. Let's wait. Now let's make a movement. Oh! Stop, stop! Okay, we're good. Alright, we are going to have to take that into consideration as well. What's this? Jumping over fences. Your characters can jump over low fences to take shortcuts. Okay. Jump over this one then. Sweet. Is anyone around here? No. Seems like this area was pretty much bombarded. Alright, so how do we... Oh, through here? Maybe? They've been complete. Sweet. Your character gained a new level and a skill point. You can spend it in your skill tree. Press I to choose the skills tab. To earn higher level skills, you need to learn three skills from the previous tier. You can see the number of skills needed to the right of your skill tree. Let's see here. Skills. Oh my goodness, this is so cool. There's uh, RPG elements to it as well. So what can we choose? Increased chance to, use, to hit using pistols. Knife throwing. We can... Take this one. Throws a knife and silently kills an enemy. Throw a knife can be picked up and used again. Uh, lowers the stamina, the stamina cost of running while in combat. 
chance of hitting using rifles. Kill low rank enemies faster when in stealth. Win chance during melee fighting is increased. Win chance? There's a chance they we might lose the, the melee combat? That is okay. Increases character's defense bonus while in cover. Defense bonus? What the hell? Guess that's our life, I don't know. If you have this skill, your partisan will have low effect on global mag activities successes chances. What does that mean? Activities success chances. Hmm. Uh, don't seem to We only have one skill point, we can let's take the knife throwing. A bunch of other skills. Increase throwing distance. Number of knives that can be thrown at the enemy. This is so cool. Alright. Uh each effect, high effect, medium. Okay, all right. And then we have a, a bunch of other skill trees, maybe? Jesus, okay. There's a tactical map as well. Pretty cool. And then encyclopedia. Okay, so this is like the uh, tutorials. There's also history here, but we don't have anything on it right now. Let me just get rid of all these, just so we know. Okay, all right. Fair enough, let's uh, crack on, shall we? Let's see, enemies traveling alone can be easily neutralized or distracted. It's much harder if you meet a group of enemies. Try not to let them see you. Okay. Is there a group of enemies coming in? Let's pick up this guy. Not sure why this question mark was here. There's not, not a group of enemies around. Place him down. Ooh. The guy right here. Can he see me? No. Uh, how can I F to throw? They've seen us. Throw it! We'll we'll you Mission. <laughs> Let's just go into the last save. What the hell? I thought I. I thought I selected to throw it. Careful now. Okay. Let's uh, level up. There we go. Okay. Oh, watch out, watch out. Right, let's take this guy out. Put him in the bushes and then wait. How do I throw the knife? A... There's F, but... Okay, maybe I didn't select it properly or something. Okay, we know this. Some of your partisans' abilities can be used at a distance. The ability icon shows the exact location where the ability will be used. Don't have a line of sight to this guy, but... This wasn't the plan. Attack, I'm hit. Okay, this is not going well. Why can't he throw the knife? I am selecting it though, I think. Quiet. Ugh, okay. Let's try this one more time. What the hell? This is like a basic skill. Well, pick him up. Put him in a bush. Am I pressing F too many times or something? Let's uh, save here, actually. Uh, shall we wait for this guy? Seen oh, I've seen them! Damn it! <laughs> Last save, come on. What is happening here? Why can't I throw the bloody knife? All right, he's coming back. If we can do this. It's gonna raise the alarm. Dead on it. Oh, we have to be really close to it. Okay, okay, all right. Get down. Yeah, he can see us from here. I'm not sure. Oh, cause he kind of turns around. Okay. We have to be really close to throw this uh, knife. And that, that is very close. Okay. Take the knife. Yep. Pick him up. Okay. I thought, because uh, I'm used to... Uh, I came from playing Desperados 3 not so long ago, so the throwing knife in uh, one of the character's skills is actually really... Uh, there's a 
it's a bigger um, range to it. All right, let's see if we can kill this guy. I'm on it. One down. Nice. No one else around here. No points in. Let's just pick the knife up. Go. Uh, what's that? Oh, we have action. Okay, they're going... Oh, shit, what's happening? You can find containers in unexpected forms and in unexpected places. For example, collect the contents of the nearest pile of stones. Okay, so we got some stones. Stone throwing is a very simple and effective way to draw an animation. Okay, so, so let me see. How do we equip this? Oh, in one of these. Okay. So we've got it on Z. Calm down. Oof. So do we have to go? Where do we have to go? Let me just pull up the map. Make your way to the roads. Okay. All right. So that's M for the map. Uh, there's no way I can pass through these guys without him seeing us. So we're gonna have to use the rock track them. Okay, cool. Call you didn't see where the rock came from. Got it. Nice. I think we made it. Hey, come on. Get up. We've almost reached the forest. Oh, I can't. The wound is too much. Leave me, Sanic. Run. Run for your life before they see you with me. What do you mean, run? Are you out of your mind? You don't leave comrades behind. I can carry you. Stand down. I'll carry him. Captain, you're alive. I, I thought the fascists got to you. I'm fine. It looks like you took a bullet. We'll find a safe place and dress your wounds. Pops has a dugout in the forest. The Germans won't find us there. How far out is it? We won't be able to carry him through the woodland and swamps. I didn't think of that. We can take him to Mikhailovo, to Uncle Vasya. He won't betray you. All right, take us there. Success! Complexity level normal, 11 minutes. And we found some resources. I wonder what they will we can do with those. Is he feeling better? The medicine hasn't kicked in yet, but he's gonna be alright. You have no idea how tough he is. A real Lesgaft man. A Lesgaft man? What's that? He's an athlete. A student at the University of Health and Sport in Leningrad. We'll spend the night here and leave in the morning. Sanek mentioned a dugout in the forest. It must be Trophims. He's a hunter? Yeah, I... Yikes! Look! The Palenzai. They're looking for us. What are we going to do? You and the sergeant stay inside. I'll go and say hi. Hold on. There's a stash under that floorboard. Take the meds and the gun. You'd make a great conspirator. Wait here. Okay, so this time we have Palitzai, which were members of the uh, Soviet Union that turns... That, that was a little description that I should have read it, but I didn't. But what I was able to gather from that uh, description was that they were like turncoats. Uh, handling over the conspirators to the uh, German forces. Let's see what this says there. You can restore your HP with medicine by placing your medkits in the item slots. For your weapon, you need to equip it and have ammunition. Press R to reload your weapon. Bullets are stored in your character's backpack. Pain kills can help your characters to heal from injuries while ignoring the pain. Okay, so do we have a... Let's That's grab good. a weapon. We have a revolver. Some bullets. What's this? 
bandage included in every soldier's gear restores a small amount of HP. Uh, painkillers, I think. Yep. They remove cranial cerebral injury. Visibility in the fog of war is reduced. Time string movement speed is reduced. Critic is impossible. Concussion. Ability cooldown increased. Fog of war vision is decreased. Hand cuts. Increased hit chance. Increased the weapon reload time. There's kidney damage, but I can't see what that does. And internal organs injuries. Damn. Man, this is a magical syringe. Uh, Pradva 172. What is this? Can I take a part? Is this like a mission item? Oh, it's a hint. Citizens of the Soviet Union, the Soviet government and its head, Comrade Stalin, have authorized me to make the following statement. Today, at 4 o'clock a.m., without any claims having been presented to the Soviet Union, without a declaration of war, German troops attacked our country, attacked our borders at many points and bombed from their airplanes our cities Zitomor Zitomir, Kiev, Sevastopol, Kaunas, and some others, killing and wounding over 200 persons. There were also enemy air raids and artillery shelling from Romanian and Finnish territory. Now that the attack on the Soviet Union has already been committed, the Soviet government has ordered our troops to repulse the predatory assault and to drive the German troops from the territory of our country. This war was has been forced upon us, not by the German people, not by German workers, peasants and intellectuals, whose sufferings we well understand, but by the clique of bloodthirsty fascist rulers of Germany who have enslaved Frenchmen, Czechs, Poles, Serbians, Norwegians, Belgians, Danes, Dutchmen, Greeks, and peoples of other nations. Ours is a righteous cause. The enemy shall be defeated. Victory will be ours. I wonder if this is an actual clipping from a, a statement Stalin made. Very intense. Alright. We do have a weapon now, so let's uh, equip it. Okay. Uh, shall we swap? Okay. So we can swap weapons with V. It's cool. So let's reload. Oh, it's already loaded. Okay. okay let's take it easy here. I don't want to be involved in the shootouts, I think. Hide in cover. When you're in cover, you're much less likely to be hit. Okay, so let's take some cover. Wow, this is so cool. Alright. And we shoot him? Is that the uh, percentage? Up top of their heads, or what is that? Did I? Oh, this is. Uh, I didn't save it. Okay. A fifty-two. Okay. Oh, it kind of changes. Let's see. So from here, forty-eight. Okay. So the the further away we are, the less chance we have. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, does he have a gun as well? Does. Let's stay in cover and start the shootout, shall we? Jeez! Oh, he does it automatically. Oh, that is so cool! What's the noise? Where's the commander? Outside, talking to the police. You're going to have to leave. <laughs> talking, the yeah. The area's a swamp, and it's been raining hard. If you're going to get to the forest, the causeway is your only chance. The causeway is just outside the village. Take the backyards, but don't get spotted. Sanic will show you the rest of the way. And what about you? Are you coming with us? I'll only slow you down. Go. I'll see you when things settle. Thanks a ton, Uncle Vasya. We can't fight without firing a shot. Let's take some weapons from the fascists. Sweet, yeah, grab their weapons. I'm not sure if the kid should be coming with us, but I guess this is war, right? Every man comes, woman and child. Uh, right, let's see, can we reload? Cool. We wasted six bullets to take care of two guys. Let's see, what's, what is this plus thing on them? Oh, because they have skills as well, and inventory. Oh my god, this is so cool. Alright. Um, can't really change these ones, but... We have two skill points. Make less noise. This is amount of HP. Uh, disguise allows you to move near an enemy without drawing enemy attention. 
ability stops when you do anything suspicious, such as using weapons or abilities. Cooldown 10 seconds and available during combats, okay? Uh, we can also... Oops, hold up. Uh, what's this? Chance to, to use... To hit using shotguns. Climb over high fences. Increase character defense bonus while in cover. So he's a partisan as well, alright. Uh, shall we go for the disguise? Yeah, we have one more skill point, so let's go... Hmm... Maybe proficiency shotguns? Why not? And... Well, actually, let me read the... So who's this guy? Alexander Ivanovich Kuzmin. So Alexander. Or shall we just call him Kuzmin by his last name? Alright, Kuzmin. Actually, it says Sanek here, so I'm not really sure. Not really sure why. Maybe it's a nickname or something. Sanek. Kuzmin Alexander Ivanovich, age 14, local, before the war, studied at school, member of the pioneer organization, lost both parents to the fascists. He lives in the forest with Trofim and dreams about avenging his family. Damn. All right. And then we have Vetisov. Nikolai Alexandrov Alexandrovich, age 24, born in Leningrad into a worker's family, a Catholic. A student of Lesgraf University of Sport and Health, joined the army under the Komsomol draft call in the first week of war. He was a sergeant in Captain Zorin's company. Cool. So let's see what skills he have. Uh, grenade throwing range. Decreased times before an explosion. Chance to hit using SMGs. Long burst. Festive uh, Fetisov shoots everyone within range in the, the ability cone. Requires SMG. Part defense bonus while in cover. Allows you to low rank enemies faster, to kill low rank enemies faster when in stealth. Chance during melee fighting is increased. Uh, let's take the uh, long burst for sure, and then uh, kill low rank enemies faster, maybe? Let's check that. Sweet. So they're all leveled up. Uh, we don't have any skill points for ourselves. His health is very low, so maybe. Can we share resources? Can I split this? Um, hand over to Vetisov and use. How do I? How do I use it? Um, how do we use the medkit? Oh, I have to equip it. Okay. Uh, on yourself. Oh, we can use it on other people as well. Okay, that's fine. So he's got the... Uh, we got the rocks. Have we got anything else that we can be using? Yeah, maybe this. That's... Okay, cool. Alright, shall we go? How do I select everyone? Let's go. Go, gents. Loot spreading. You have limited space in your inventory. To make room, select an item with your mouse, then drag it... Drag and drop into another partisan's character portrait to give it to them. Or you can right click the right mouse button to hand over. Okay, cool. But they did that. Uh, let's go this way. Follow the uh, giant's question mark icons. Squad control. Now do you have a squad of partisans under your control to select every partisan. Press F1 to select certain partisans. Press numbers 1 to 3. Yes. Go. Cool. So we go reach the village. Okay, that's the objective. There's a body in the way. Who are these polizai, Sonic? They speak Russian, and they look pretty local. I can't believe that our people could sell out to the enemy. They're no longer our people. Traitors! That's what those polizai are. Serving the commandant for money. Some are worse than the Germans. What kind of person would turn to the fascists and bully their own people? Well, there's a couple of them over there. Let's ask them. <laughs> Let's uh, fire some questions in their direction. Actually, let me s check the settings here for the uh, voice level. Let me push that a little bit. Here we go. It's probably better, right? 
uh, effective shooting. Different weapons are effective at different ranges. To reach maximum efficiency, you may need to get closer to your enemy and use cover to decrease the chance of being hit during combats. You can load enemy corpses to find some equipment after killing them. Uh, did we do that earlier? I think we did. They did it automatically, I think. Alright. Okay, so let's Down. see. Uh, they're not really looking at us. This is kind of scary. You guys only have one bullet. I mean, what's the... Uh, 65. Maybe let's all go take cover under this cart. Okay, they're both in cover, but Vasilev is not. Okay, so let me... Six... Vasilev, I called him Vasilev, but Vetisov, sorry. Sanek and Vetisov, 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 Sanek and uh, Zorin. <laughs> Gotta remember the names. I think we're ready to go into combat, don't you think, guys? Oh, let's uh, kill them all. Let's save. Get something goes wrong. Let's go. Nice one, boys. Calm down. Reloads. Oops. Actually, I think I cancelled that. Nice. Slope them. Calm down. Uh oh, some bandages, ammunitions, take all. Oh, is that from all of them? Or these two? Oh, that's cool. Alright. So let's see what we have. Um There's a squad morale as well. Normal morale. Uh what does that mean? Your characters are in depression, your hit chances increase, ability cooldowns are increased. Okay, and this increases our hit chance. Characters can sprint longer as well. And ability cooldowns are decreased. Okay, cool. So who uses these types of bullets? You. Uh, I think we're good for now. Give this to him, I guess. Yeah. Everyone good? Wait, let's carry on. Oh, there's some more polytie over here. Group combat. Controlling a group can be a challenge. Use hideouts to increase your character's chance of survival. Tactical mode slows time and allows you to coordinate everything your characters do. To activate or deactivate tactical mode, press spacebar. To get more information about your weapon's hit chance over your cursor over your target, the higher the chance to hit, the more fields... Yeah, kind of change that. Uh, if you're not in combat, you can hide in cover and enemies will not be able to see you. Use this to set up an ambush. Mm-hmm. Okay, so... Alright. Um, just checking if there's a, a way to flank them or something. Can we jump over this fence? Yeah, we can. So we can maybe... We can maybe get this cover here. I guess if we're in cover, he can't see us, right? So maybe we can place one guy here, one guy here, another guy here. Okay, alright. I'd love to have a machine gun company here instead. Alright. Calm down. Okay, you go here. Stay here. Actually, let me see. Is he us? Okay, no, he does. We're not getting caught here. You stay here. Actually, you. No, you have, only have one bullet. Hmm. Quiet. Actually, Zorin, I'm gonna make you come all the way. Go all the scary. way there. Betisov, stay oh, here. Oh. The recon. Enemies are alarmed. Okay, now we can save. My recon experience comes in handy. Uh, can I go across this area? I don't think I can without being seen. Um, hold up. No, 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 wait. Go here. Let me, let me go around here. Yeah. Much better. Oh, there's even way... You can go inside the house as well. Hold up. Can we shoot through the windows? I think we can. Calm down. Come on. Now, is there anything here that could be useful? I don't think so. Okay, stay in cover then. 
Okay, cool. Are we ready for combat, maybe? Uh, there's more guys over there. At least one more. Okay, so let's go into tactical modes. My recon experience comes in handy. So he's gonna shoot this guy. Uh, you're gonna shoot this guy. 50%. You're gonna shoot this guy and go, maybe. Maybe we could have used this ability, to be honest. Oh well, we use it later. How do I confirm this? There we go. Come on. Who's out, who's out the bullets? Hold up, can you... Can we move them in combat? I think we can. Oh, that's cool. That's so cool. Shoot him! Hold, hold up, hold up. Can you stop shooting? 2%, stop shooting him, please. No points. So he doesn't... Okay. Never mind. There we go. Wasted a lot of bullets, but... We do have a lot, to be honest. Calm down. I want to be useful. Nice one, boys. And it did take us a while too, <laughs> but that's fine. Now let's take all of this. What are these eggs? Very tasty. Okay. Another guy here we can loot. How long do we have to hide here? Oh, a knife. And what's this? Broken weapon. What is that? What did I say? Hold up. Can be taken apart. Okay. Alright, let's check. So, who can take them apart? Not really sure. Uh, so there's more bullets here for you. There's some more bullets here for you. A couple medkits. There's a knife as well. Betisov, take this. So we can only have three uh, med packs at one time. See, we got skill points. Character defense bonus while in cover. Yeah, let's uh, take the hit chance. Wait. All right, cool. We survived. I think that was the first level, to be honest. Touch the swamp. We're almost there. An ambush tactics to deploy to destroy patrolling enemies take cover to gain an advantage. There's suitable there's a suitable place in front of you now. You can change behavior mode during combat. If defensive mode is turned on, partisans won't shoot until an order is given. During defensive mode, partisans' chance to be hit is decreased. You can activate this mode by pressing T button. Oh, okay. And Let's uh, go, into the bushes again. go into the bushes here. Okay. Um, let's save here. Let's take cover here, boys. I'd love to have a machine gun company here instead. Not sure if they can see us, but careful now. Yeah, I don't... yeah, they can't see us when we're in cover. I'm gonna go into tactical mode here when they stop. Get Vasilov and spray them. Oh, I don't have a. Oh, I don't have a SMG. Never mind then. Uh, fire. Follow me. The battle is over. Cool. I should have. To be honest, I should have selected uh, each of our guys to select one of them instead of all shooting at the same dude. But I guess this worked out. There's a box over there. Is there anything? Is there anything in these houses? Maybe. Can't really see. No, maybe there's. Hold up. Let's check this. Oh, there's some sacks. We have to take risks. Oh, stealing items from local will decrease squad morale. Okay, uh -huh. that's fine. We don't need to do that right now, to be honest. We do have some... Uh, some stuff. Uh, we can loot this, probably. I can do it. 
Ooh, a grenades. And what's this? Gun oil. Taking care of your personal weapon is what distinguishes a civilized person from a Neanderthal. I'm waiting for my second wind. Grenades deal every damage and allow you to neutralize groups of enemies at once. Well, let me just... Who's got the grenade? I think this uh, Vetisov guy is a grenade lover. Give you some bullets here. Here we go. Okay. Is there a group of guys up here? The enemy is near. There's a bunch of them around here, though. Okay. Uh, we can take cover. Oh, I was going to say. Uh, where can we enter this house from? There's a door right here. Okay. Careful now. Okay, I'm gonna gonna try to go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Easy now. And as soon as this guy comes along, me. what? Oh no. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna throw my knife, kill him. I'm on it. No stopping us. I'll get my revenge. Oh, what the hell? Okay, let's uh, let's go back. <laughs> I thought the enemy's near. Maybe they heard me or something. Let's not use the throwing. Uh, switch. Find cover now. Attack. Cover oh yeah, they they look at us. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Get down. Yeah, this guy is like looking right at us. Oh. Oh, maybe there's a window. Hold up. Maybe there's a window we can kill him. Just gonna try this one more time. We can't exactly. Oh, we can throw a rock outside as well. So maybe we do that, distract them, and then kill him. Yeah, we can do that. Come back in, buddy. Is he...? Okay. Kill him! Nice. I'm not sure if they'll be able to see his corpse, though. Charge. Yep. <laughs> okay, let's try this one more time. We gotta take care of the corpse. It's fair enough. Is there, is there any way I can speed up the the game? I'm not sure. Maybe not. Uh, yeah, I don't think there is a button for us to. Weapon reloading, turn on passive modes. Okay. Should probably drag him back. Get, get him, get him. Drag him like here. Attack! Ah, oh, damn it! Ugh. Okay, let's try this <laughs> again. Maybe let's not kill him. Tread lightly. See, like they can't see this area. They found me. You can't see this area, so maybe as soon as he comes in, I kill him. <laughs> we can try. I'm gonna throw the rock as soon as he starts walking, and then... Uh, yeah. Here we go. Your father just won't forget you. Close the door. There we go. Close it. Close, 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 close. Please, please, please. Follow me. God damn it. Try this one more. <laughs> My god, why is this so difficult? Um, right, you two, in the meantime. I hope we're not getting caught here. I don't know what to do with you guys. Anyways, let's get ready. There you go. There's someone here. Attack. Oh, what the fuck are you. He discovered us. Tread lightly. Find cover now. Maybe he saw us throwing the rock or something. 
There's a medicine cabinet here as well. They found me. Take For the comrades! Ah, what the hell? This is not this is not working out so Careful. Not working out very well this is. I swear I threw the rock earlier. There we go. What done. the fuck, man? How how do they again? Are we able to do this? Careful now. Also go through the barn here. It seems. Oh, because I had the I had the weapon selected for some reason. Okay. Ugh. I think I think that was it. <laughs> Here we go for the umpteenth time. We can do this. Take a break from life. Here we go. I think that's it. Yeah, they can't see him. Sweet. Let's save. Okie dokie. Um, now what? Let's get you two. Oh, my fault. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, what's this? Place all your characters in this specific area to exit the location. By pressing the M button, you can open the tactical map and see your current tasks, as well as the exit for your current location. Okay, but these guys might have some, like... I'll trade some. Go, inside. Huh? Take all of this stuff. What do you want? Okay, uh... I'll trade softly. I can place one guy here. I can probably place the kids around this area. Yeah, I think that's fine. Um, and we can take Vetis of... Oh, Fetis of, no? That was his name, right? Oh, he does shit. The kid might be... Might be busted now. Okay, no, he wasn't. Let's put... Put him here. Oh, actually. Throw... Oh, we can throw the grenade and kill all these guys. Yeah, let's do that. And, uh... Actually, let's just... Start blasting. Wait, let's go. Fire. Boom, nice. Oh, this one got away. Quiet. Let's go. Nice. Nice one, boys. Nice one, nice one. Uh-huh. Oh, there's a ton of stuff around here. I think that was all the uh the guys. Collective huh? stuff. Uh, is there anything else I can take? Let's distribute this. Oh, there's a bunch of bunch of bullets here. Uh, what's this? Shells. You can make a whistle or a lighter out of a good shell. Okay. What else? Dry herbs. Can be brewed in. Can be brewed to instead of tea leaves. Okay. Uh oh, okay. They kinda of swapped places. Go, that's fine. Fine. Everyone's still good. Sweet. This turned out very nice. I looted the guy inside. Cool. Let's go. Where's the um reach the swamp? Get down. We didn't necessarily have to kill them. 
That's it. Oh. Hey, hmm? I didn't put a step wrong. God damn it, guys. Nothing Get out of the way. Oof, he almost saw us. Yeah, let's save. I hope they won't notice us. Uh, we have some cover here. I'd love to have a machine gun company here instead. Ah, oh, how the hell? Okay, uh, we don't have the grenade anymore. Which is a bit uh, worrisome. But we do have cover. So... 51%. Uh, Seventy. Let's get the sixty-five, and then the kids. Yeah, because it's like thirteen percent, and the kids is really bad. Let's try and do this. Let's go. What's F? Oh, it's disguise, right? Man, we failed all the. Uh... Come on, guys, shoot them. There we go. One down, two down. The battle is over. Sweet. Did they lose any health? That's good. We uh, distribute this again. Okay, I think that's good. Sweet. Nice one, boys. Uh, actually, hold up. W what is this? Photograph. Uh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Crew at muster. Cool. Is this an actual photograph? Maybe. Okay, I think uh, we finished the, the mission uh, as we go into the next one. I'm going to take a quick... Actually, ooh, let's uh, level up these guys. Shall we? Uh, hit chance. Defense. Grenade throwing range. It's time before explosion. Actually, yeah, we can do this. Um, let's see. Makes less noise when moving. Yeah, we could do... Um, bu -bu -bu -bum. Character defense bonus while on cover. Maybe that's best. Alright, sweet. And we unlocked the next tier. Okay, cool. Right, we're gonna take a quick break right here. That's the end of the tutorial mission and the first mission. And uh, yeah, so far, I mean, really enjoying the game. It's a bit different from uh, Desperado Studio Commandos. Because it has those uh, RPG elements to it. And we'll be able to be uh, craft stuff in the future. Obviously, we have these like parts here we can craft stuff. So, and we have a HP bar as well. And the combat's really nice. I, I wasn't expecting it. So it's not as stealthy as I thought it would be. And and there's a whole lot of combat involved into it as well. So this will be a very interesting game to play out. Let me know what you think if you want to do so in the comments below. And uh, hopefully, I'll see you in the next episode. Thank you so much. Bye bye.